Hey guys, welcome back to my small engine repair channel. In today's quick video here, I want to show you what your options are if you bought a snowblower with wheels like this one here and you're not satisfied with them. So I get a lot of customers who've bought these machines. They're actually good machines, but the customer just doesn't like this type of wheel and they're regretting buying the machine and they think that they have to go out and buy a whole new machine just to have better wheels on it. So if you're one of those people, don't worry about it. You don't have to go buy a whole new machine. In this video today, I'm going to show you what to do so that you can have wheels with rubber tires on them again. So here's a close look at these wheels. They're airless tires. They're basically made of soft plastic. Now the pros of having these wheels is you never have to worry about a flat tire again. What the customers complain about is that they say there's not enough traction with them in the winters that we get here in Canada. So if this is the issue you're having, you're not happy with these wheels, what you can do is either go to your local small engine shop. They may have some old wheels from other machines that they've scrapped. And by the way, I actually have one in the shop here that the engine is blown up in it. And it's got some good wheels with the rubber tires. So if that's the case, take off this bolt here. Your wheel will come right off. Now when doing this conversion, what you want to make sure is that you have the same style of hub here. It has to be exactly like this one here. This is an older rim as you can see, but it is exactly the same. And it will fit perfectly on this machine. There you go. Now you just put your bolt and you've got your machine converted to rubber tires. Now it's that easy guys and don't worry about it offsetting the machine. I've done a lot of these conversions for people because I do have a lot of these wheels here in my collection from scrap machines and it does not affect this machine at all. It's not awkward to use after or anything like that and most people are really happy to have the old rubber tires back on. So this snowblower here that you see has rubber tires. It's made by MTD. It's basically the same machine as that Troy built with just subtle differences. So basically if you ended up putting these tires on the Troy built, this is what your machine would be like. And as I mentioned in the video, it will not affect the functionality or how high it sits. And this blower here is a good example of that. So what you're best to do is go to your local small engine shop and ask them if they have some of these older wheels left in their collection. Because if you can find a set of good used wheels like this, you're going to pay a fraction of the price than if you have to go buy the tire and the rim brand new. When I scrap a machine here, so like this one here will be scrapped, I save all those wheels because I know at some point a customer is going to come in and want to convert these wheels to the rubber ones. And sometimes you might get lucky if you look on local classifieds, you might be able to buy an old scrap machine for parts that has those older wheels on them. Or even sometimes people are throwing out machines that don't run and they stick them at the end of their driveway. I hope this video has helped you. If you have any questions, please comment in the video comment section. Also, please comment as to how you're making out with the original wheels that were on this machine, these ones here, and tell us the pros and cons that you've observed using these wheels. Thanks for watching, guys, and have a great day.